7 o'clock. What's up, everyone? Andrew Reiner here with episode 13 of what will surely be Game Informer's longest super <laughs> replay ever. Not just in terms of episodes, but the length of time it takes to release it. The, Kyle most, Hilliard. the most consistent super replay in Game Informer history returns. We're coming at you twice a week on a regular schedule. <laughs> like, I am so weird. sorry it's taking us so long yeah. to play this game. But we do have Sonic the Hedgehog Yes, going at the same time. Lots of crazy stuff going on in terms of our lives as well. Yeah, which will be, you'll find out, you know, more about soon on GameInformer.com. Yeah, Kyle's writing magazines and books and yeah. notes to his wife. and Yeah, those aren't, those aren't public, though. Those are just for her. I'm writing music and magazines We're and busy. blogs. And We're a pair of busy dudes. Well, what's going on here? <laughs> the audio. That's like the best voice acting that I've heard in the whole series. <laughs> Hey, 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 what we got going on here? Are you members of the heavens? What? What about it? <laughs> I'm looking for a man named Ren. Can I see him? <laughs> hey, this kid must be joking. That is a woman's haircut, I think. I'm looking for Ren. Let me see him. <laughs> hey, hey, oh, oh, what we got here, man? <laughs> That's the same. <laughs> it's looping it. <laughs> Oh gosh! Don't you dare mention the boss's name so easily. Uh oh, okay. Now it's been like a long time you. since I've played this game. This oh, punch! Crap. Let's see. Okay. Okay. So okay. Ren. So far, so good. Oh, look at that. All right. Uh, uh, uh. Wow, that guy really wants uh, you to take something. He really. He's what's going on? Oh, here? he's down. Haircut's down. Here we go. Um, You're in trouble. Okay. Am I? Yeah, okay. four blips left, but I think this fight's almost... Oh, come on, come on, come on. There. Oh, oh, there's more! Secret man! There we go. I got... He was weak, though. Whew. Okay. I'm oh. back into it. I'm back into That's it. That's a concussion. I got it. I got it. I was double tapping over an X, making things happen. Feeling pretty good about this so far. Let me, put, like, let me take my hands off the controller, because surely nothing will happen. That's right. Oh, pick him up. Yeah. Hold him over your head. <laughs> Bane, Batman style. See Ren. All right. This way. Okay. Well that's, done. That's how you get things done. That's the best beginning we've ever had. And will ever have. <laughs> So things got a little heated in the last episode. Yeah, I'm trying to remember what happened. I know I did some quick time events probably really well. Okay, I remember uh, this guy. Okay. Beat this guy too. Or we're cool now. Someone says oh. we need 500 gold to see Ren. Who is he? Uh, can I just He's beat up a bunch of dudes? business with Ren. <laughs> <laughs> Fine. Uh, Go through. Beverly Hills. Okay, so we'll wait till the cutscene's done here. Mike Daiwan, the best commenter ever on yes. Shenmue Super Replays. Our rock. Says, um, 500 is easy to earn. Just proceed in the game till the Heavens Gang asks you for 500, then go to the docks, Fortune Spear, and work there carrying crates. Okay. We've done that. Hmm. And then I can probably just sleep at the free place. Just work for a couple days. Yes. Yeah, so after the workday, a coworker dude will show you a move. He was close to the water side of the pier. With this move, you could go back into the Beverly Hills Wharf area and do the street fight challenge against the caveman. <laughs> he did that in quotations. Okay. This is only use this move you just learned, and you will earn a a trap. He used the S word load of money. A stuff load. Yeah. In a very short amount of time. A short load. Whoa. Okay. There we go. 
They were groaning in echoes. <laughs> Right, this music all of a sudden. Oh, there we go. It's like the beginning of a Marilyn Manson song. <laughs> okay, here we go. That move, someone told me that move a long time ago when we first started playing Rio. this. The beautiful Rio. The beautiful Rio. Beautiful Rio. There we go. That move, man. That move is killer. Yeah, oh. wait your turn, everybody. Come yeah, on. Someone else in the comments. I want to find wait, it. I want to give them proper Wait, what's credit. going on? Is this supposed to happen? <laughs> I'm not supposed to be still be playing, am I? That was weird. What just happened? I think I just got overwhelmed. Like, like that was what I was supposed to take away from that, right? What? It, it was like our game crashed. It's like eternal darkness. I don't think so. I think that was supposed to happen. Why? What? Unless this is the What is going on with these boats I'm now? I'm very confused. Like, it just seemed like it was supposed to be insurmountable odds, right? Mm -hmm. Like, it didn't matter Maybe. that I was actually doing pretty well. Maybe. Okay, yeah, see, now I'm being healed by this uh, kid, kid on the boat. I was doing well. I think I, if that hadn't faded to black, I, I think right? I would have I made it. How many guys did you take down yeah, in the first game of that one? Like, 70? At the end of the game? Yeah, 60 Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. What? What? Where are we? Oh. Out on the waters of Beverly Hills Wharf. Okay. Beverly Hills Wharf. You shouldn't move yet. <laughs> Relax and spend the night here. Yeah. Thanks. Trying to find where we are in the walkthrough here. I don't know if I've ever... I guess I'll... I don't know if I'll ever be in that situation where I wake up in pain after some, like, cataclysmic event and I, ha I just feel the need to get up and move and someone has to be like, don't move. Like, I don't, do you think that'll ever happen to me in my life? Well, I had knee surgery. Yeah. And I got that exact advice. Really? <laughs> like, you want like, don't, don't get up yet. The second you woke up from anesthesia, you were like, I gotta go. I what? gotta go save. I gotta find, <laughs> I gotta find Ren. Well, <laughs> first, Beverly Hills. first what happened was my sister was sitting next to me and I woke up. I woke up in the operating room and I wanted to like hug everyone. <laughs> okay. Because I was like all drugged up. Yeah. But it was too shy and decided not to say anything. And <laughs> then I was in my room. I wanted to hug everybody. I was in my room watching a rerun of Family Ties on TV, and my sister was sitting next to me talking to me. Yeah. And just mid speech, as I was talking back to her, I just vomited all over the place. <laughs> and I guess that's a normal thing when you're on, like, if it's like morphine or something, uh, yeah. your body rejects it originally. Um, so I wanted to get up and because I had puke to everywhere. Clean up. Yeah. yeah uh, that's reasonable. And they were, the nurse came in and it's like, don't don't get up. Don't move. <laughs> okay. And then they changed me and all that stuff. And it was You're super embarrassing. Already? It was very nice, though. Then they gave me I a puke tray. <laughs> Do you remember... This is a really vague memory because I was young, getting tubes put in my ear. Mm. And, like, I remember being taken out of the operating room on the gurney and kind of, like, coming to and really wanting to hang my arm off the side of the gurney. And the doctor just kept putting it up. And I kept, like... <laughs> Defiantly, like I'm gonna, I'm gonna hang my arm off, and they just wouldn't let me do it. What's this? I didn't fight very hard. Kid gave us fire. Okay. Members of the heavens carry this lighter. Show it at the gate of Beverly Hills Wharf. They'll let you in. All right. I, I want to be in a club that has something know. like that. Oh, uh, that's a that's called a gang. I don't think you want to be in a gang. The heavens don't know about this place. Thanks. Uh, that's the kid from the beginning of the game, right? I think so. I mean, I don't know why else he would help me. Heaven's Zippo. All right. Progress. But you should check your um, items, see if you have any moves that you can learn. Oh, okay. Remember you get, like, documents? Documents. Um, okay. Let's see. I don't know if you have any, but yeah, someone said you so. should check big, and see. Big front letter to father. Would they be, like, listed here? You know, I don't remember how they did it. Chen intro letter. There might be, what is this, my notebook? Snapshots, event photos, flyers, move handbook. Let's see. Whoa. Like, do I... Oh my god, it's like I'm playing Resident Evil 7 all over again. Um... Yeah, what do you think of that so far? I'm enjoying it. I, I more than I thought I would. Maybe, maybe, I... 
I think I kind of went in with low expectations, maybe? Uh, perhaps unfairly, but like I have have not wanted to be putting it down, if that makes so sense. So you saw I gave it a decent play. review, and you're like, oh boy, this is something <laughs> Reiner likes. <laughs> uh, I guess I gotta play it. It's supposed Actually, to be a big series. Mostly I'm at odds with just like the way the game was sort of sold kind of like I wish I wish right? the marketing Isn't that weird the marketing should have just been like hey by the way this is like Resident Evil 1 but first person and I like because that comes through like within the first hour of the game you kind of understand that you're like oh this feels like very classic Resident Evil but from a different perspective this is cool and uh I didn't get that at all from even the demos I played I didn't really get that what is the one big difference between how old Resident Evils were sold and this new one I'll tell you. I was going to say, I wasn't around. Game Informer's Tim Turry mm. joined Capcom when all this crap started happening. He, it was his, all him. He did it. He's all smoke and mirrors with his marketing. <laughs> like, you think the game's this, but guess uh, what? Uh, 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 I'm, uh, sure, I'm sure he had very little to do with those with those higher up decisions, I'm assuming. I think he's I like really president now or co-president. Is he the president of Capcom? Yeah. Oh, he should get Mega Man X going. Excuse me. Yeah. Oh, I need to go. Okay, we got sidetracked here. I want to meet Ren of Heavens. Push him. In we the don't want to get. Yeah. Well, I do. Peace. This is like a whole new era. Uh, it's, yeah. Oh, this is the. Okay, this is where the, the sort of casino was that the police officer told me to go check out. And the broken audio on the 360 <laughs> version sounds like a Drop Kubrick dead. soundtrack. Uh oh. Drop dead. Why? <laughs> Just whiffed with Hello? that kick. And went down. <laughs> okay. That guy's awesome. That guy's a hero. <laughs> that guy went for it, man. You. Hey, are we ever going to see Gollum again? Oh, I don't know. Well, didn't someone say that he he was supposed to be on the boat, and that was kind of the idea for Shenmue 2, was he going to be on the boat? But That's then that right. all fell through. Uh, that dude is gone. Um I don't he know if did his to, job. Am I supposed to chase him? I don't understand. Yeah, I gotta find where we are, and I don't, I don't know even know what to look at. Well, look in your notebook for a second. Let's see. Woke up on Wong's boat. In Wong's Beverly boat. So if yeah. I search that, that should be everything we need. So I. Oh, here he is. Is this you? Sure. Was that him? No, that was a different hey, guy. Hey, you. Are you talking to me? <laughs> what the hell are you wandering around here for? I. I don't know. I. I'm looking for Ren. What? What do you want from Ren? I have no business with you. you Unless you're bastard. Ren. Only person I need to talk to is Ren. Don't waste my time. This is a, like, with a nasty place. Everyone is mean. Do I have to fight? That'd be awesome if you do. Yeah! <laughs> I just... <laughs> I accidentally went after one of the guys who I was not talking to. It's like Why punch the out the arcade game. Why is the perspective change? I mean, it's kind of neat, I guess. You must have hit a button. I don't think so. I mean, when that guy just cornered me for no reason, it switched to that. Okay, so if you lose a battle here, don't worry about it too much. Um, you simply return to wherever you were before the battle commenced. Okay. Just find another way to progress. Then who does know? Probably Cool Z. Ooh, cool Z. Z. Yeah, a big fellow with a mohawk wears sunglasses. Cool Z. Cool Z. So that's what we're looking for. You just wiping blood away from your mouth? What yeah, I had a little cut on my lip. There. Oh my god! I'm sorry. I'll be okay. It's all right. It was like that battle you really got into. <laughs> it's like the Matrix. Yeah, you're actually getting sustaining real damage. That's right. <laughs> okay, so I. Um, so we've been gone for what a week and a half, two weeks. Uh, it feels like years. Who are you anyway? Where is Cool Z? Where is Cool what Z? Do you want? I, apparently, no, to just fight just everyone. Just I don't know. Uh, you punk! <laughs> You're really getting on my nerves. <laughs> Wait, are you British? <laughs> <laughs> You're really getting on my nerves. Uh. But the universe has been working against Kyle and I. Yeah. Like, weather has been an issue here in Minnesota. It snows here a lot. Um, that has prevented some stuff. The studio problems. Uh, okay, right, took this a is not going well. Oh, it's not. Holy moly. Wow. What is going on? I can't see. Two blips left. Two guys left. One blip. 
half a blip, you're dead. Ah, oh, okay, but it's not a big deal, you said, right? Or shouldn't be anyway. Look at that, pathetic. <laughs> I feel like I did pretty well, all things considered. Uh... Oh, so this is just like beat down alley. <laughs> Yeah, do I just keep picking? Because I gotta find Cool Z, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Where could he be? Well, there's more. I could just start picking fights with people, I guess. Like, should I just go fight these guys? Who are you anyway? Where is Cool Z? <laughs> what do you want? Cool Z. None of your business. Just tell me where Cool Z is. You punk! <laughs> Don't be a smart ass! Guys, you're just like shouting at me. Like I feel like I'm not the one at fault here. Yeah, the walkthrough says the camera switches to this view for some reason. So All right, we did not change the game in any way. There we go. Nice job. I uh, yeah, I don't. I guess maybe it's just to kind of mix it up. I mean, it's sort of interesting, but it's just it's weird. Okay, we're getting close to the five hundred dollar point. Okay. Ugh. All right. I'm, I'm sorry. Where's Cool Z? Most likely at the scrap heap. Where's that? <laughs> I've got a map in my pocket. Hey, all right. Um, Paul Cyric asks, how are you guys feeling about this compared to the first game so far? Scrap. Seems almost identical. Is there anything that stands out or feels different? Um, being able to wait for story events is a big deal. Um, it helps a lot. Um, I'm I'm a little more confused by this map. I don't know if it benefits from being bigger, but I also kind of feel that way about games in general. Like I don't know if their games are improved necessarily by having larger maps. Uh, I just like them to be dense with lots of interesting things. Um, yeah, no, that, I, I there's there's some improvements I think uh, overall. You know, I yeah. think this is a better game. I kind of miss the intimacy of the small city. Yeah. You know, doing the little things like with the cat. I felt like I knew the people better. I don't really feel like I have much of a connection to anyone except for Joy and, you know, the guy that's running the duck race. Yeah, yeah. Those are kind of the recurring. So I think it loses that. Uh, again, you know, just that kind of con intimate connection. Um, but I do feel that them switching it up like this is a good thing, like giving it a little bit more of a broader city to explore. Yeah. Makes you feel like you're a little more isolated as a character. Um, he's a little lost. I kind of like that. Yeah. Um, you know, not just us being lost in the city. Actually, you've done a really good job navigating. Better. I. By the way, I passed by like a big... Do you think that's the scrap heap? Oh. I mean, that's, that's that, gotta be something. Guy in the middle, is that Mohawk? I don't want to fight that dude. <laughs> Did you see that guy get his ass handed to him? Can I just talk to somebody? I mean, I guess I can go... Oh. Ooh, I don't want to... See that icon that's showing up in the blue there? Oh, yeah. There's a... Well, there's also... What a... a oh, let me go to the walkthrough. I'm not, Okay, I'm going to keep picking fights with random people uh, in the middle of alleyways. Okay. They said, Find they, the center of the wharf where there's a street fight occurring. Finding the way to Cool Z's hangout should be simple enough. Damn, kid! From the center, what's happening? I don't know. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <let's see. laughs> he called me a damn kid and then just didn't even get a single punch in. <laughs> From the uh, center ring, south, run southwest. Okay, southwest. And continue to press southward until you can head left down a set of stairs. Okay. Yeah, I look. The map doesn't. It says go to the scrap heap. So what is southwest? Uh, southwest so is. So that'd be that way, this way, down that way, yeah. Okay, southwest. And then we're looking for. Keep heading southward until okay. you find stairs. Okay. And just keep getting in fights. Damn, kid! Oh, man. I like the way that guy dresses. <laughs> they're all like. They're all. They could be like warrior gang members. Come out to play? Yeah. You know, supposedly that line was improvised. Drop with the dead. bottles on the fingers. Oh, really? Yeah. Huh. Like, he just kind of randomly came up with that. It was a good actor. movie back in the day. I've never watched it in full. I don't know. I've seen, like, bits and pieces of it, but... There's so many movies from the 70s and 80s now that... Oof. All right, stairs, right? Yep. Okay. And then... Just run straight from there and turn right into the scrap heap to find Cool Get Z and again. his bronies. Why does everyone so mad at me? 
You're in their territory, man. You're not supposed yes, to be there. But I wow! Have, I have a lighter, though. Yeah, what was that all about? Well, they showed a lighter to the guy when they Don't were going into Beverly Hills. I know, but once you're in there, you'd think... Yeah. Why would they think you're bad? I don't know. It's I have like a, you're part of them. Guys, I have a lighter. I'm cool now. Okay, there's the junk heap. Okay, so we're just going here then. Okay. Oh, yeah, this looks like a junk heap. I'm guessing. Okay. Yeah, this... Cool Z? That yeah, you? we'll see. Or you could be called a kid and get beat up. <laughs> oh, is this... Uh, what was... Oh, man, I forgot his name. The guy that sold hot dogs in the last game. I remember you. I saw you. What do you want? <laughs> it's like they have the speed of the song turned down. I've or something. got no business with you guys. It's <laughs> a brazen move right there. He's the guy that stole your bag. Where's Red? Yeah. What? <laughs> you got any money? Where can I meet him? If you want to see him, bring yeah, there five hundred dollars. That's how they get you. Five hundred dollars. Yeah, Ren only meets those who make donations. What if I beat you up? Yeah, so there the walkthrough saying go to Fortune's Pier, um, hit up any of the various gambling spots, bet everything you have, you know, save before you do it, reload. Yeah, okay. And just keep doing that. But there's also I like the idea of um, that we got in the comments of getting that move. That shows off more of the game, too, from Mike Daiwan. All right. Yeah, also, I, I mean, I kind of want to just work. I don't want to, like, have to be reloading saves. Cause... Yeah, let's let's try that. So maybe I can just go try to do a couple days' work at the moving boxes? Is that uh, right? That's what yeah, Mike Daiwan Yeah, let's go move suggested? some boxes so we can f fight the caveman. Yeah. Okay. Um... Roy Gebiv says, I think your most famous ducks discussion in episode nine really missed the mark. Donald and Daphne, uh, Donald and Daffy are definitely the most famous ducks, but I think Darkwing Duck and Scrooge McDuck easily outrank Howard the mm. Duck on that list. Yes, yeah, I yeah. agree. Yeah. Daffy, I don't think we mentioned Daffy. I kind of forgot about Scrooge. That that seems like a big oversight um, on our part. I apologize. I think we that. talked about Scrooge. Yeah. You know, I played, I was playing Kingdom Hearts 2 randomly this weekend and like, Scrooge McDuck just gives you a skateboard? Yeah. And, like, you can skate around the town, and there's no purpose to it. It doesn't... As near as I can tell, it's not like I was gaining experience or, like, gaining anything from doing it. It was just, like, Scrooge McDuck was like, hey, here's a skateboard. Yeah. I was like, what? Couldn't you... There's, like... It, it just struck me as extra odd in a game that's just full of oddities. That an old duck gave you a skateboard for yeah. no reason? Yeah. Like, it should be... I mean, there's so many other... Like, why not Goofy's son? Like, he should give me a skateboard or something, you know? I like those games. Uh, yeah, I do too. I'm looking forward to three. Boy, uh, when is when do you think we get three? 2018? Mm, yeah, 2019? I don't know. I think, I like, what little they've shown of it, like, little sections of it appear to be polished. You know what I mean? Like, what they've shown doesn't feel early. They just haven't shown very much of it, you know? Just Nomura's comments lately have been yeah, troublesome. Let me yeah. see if I can find those real quick. Where do I... Okay, so this is Fortune's Pier. Yeah, you need to find the box moving guys. Yeah. I think they're in Fortune's Pier, right? Yeah. <laughs> sure. Can I just go work at 12.19 in the afternoon? Is that cool? Okay, Silicon Era. There was an interview uh, in Famitsu. They translated it. Here we go. Oh, is that Joy's motorcycle? Joy nearby? Hmm. Here's these guys, I think. So here's what's the development status on Kingdom Hearts 3? Production process is difficult. Is difficult than what we've had up until now. So I can't just give Excuse you a general me. idea. But I could huh. say that there are worlds that still remain untouched. All right. We've advanced on the Which production worlds that have yet to be announced. Hey, so we out. can't show them for now. As far as development status goes, there's still a ways to go. Okay. Yeah, I guess it's so we got a ways to go. Me. Hey. Do you job? I wonder what happened there. It's pretty fun. I don't know. That game's gotta be hard here. as hell to get I see. like approvals from Disney and yeah. all that. I mean when we went to talk we went Disney Infinity was on our you cover. Workers Pier and it's down past Pigeon Park. Um, I see. And just just sort of like talking to those guys about the process of like getting approvals for what is Disney Infinity was kind of a 
light sort of cheery game you know that was mm-hmm. a lot of it was just like yeah it doesn't matter they're all toys it's fun i can't imagine the approval process of getting something that's like no this is a serious story beat uh where goofy has to tell mickey you know such and such like they have to get so many things joy hello so i bet that's why Hi, those games take so long joy. yeah yeah i totally agree with you it's just gotta be a nightmare here? over there does it matter to you <laughs> oh I guess not. Are we friends or like... Yo, I wanted to ask you. Yeah? You know Uncle Chen in Yokosuka, right? Yeah. Uh, okay, yeah. Then, do you know Guizan? Guizan. Have we yes, talked about course. this? Really? How is he doing? Are you she close to Guizan? Calling us out for yeah, being liars? he's blunt, just like you. But didn't she reveal that nice she's person. like his, her, his nephew or her niece? Yeah. His Whenever niece Guizan or something? comes to Hong Kong... He tells me all about Japan. Really? You don't have to yell, we Joy. Visited Hong Kong. <laughs> hey, when's he coming to Hong Kong? What is going on? Do you know? <laughs> Dude, we we'll probably just run away. To Hong Kong for a while. <laughs> so what sorry I engaged this conversation. He got Joy. injured, saving me. Injured to save you? What happened? What happened? <laughs> it has something to do with Yuanda Zoo, right? I. I followed a man to Hong Kong. Young Da Zhu knows about this man. Guizhen was supposed to come to Hong Kong with me. But right before boarding the ship, he was attacked by one of the man's associates. Mm. Who is this man? You don't need to know. That's right. It's better for you to stay out of this. No way! Guizhen is my friend! Was I he he was like the bodyguard guy. guy, right? He's the reason why yeah. my friend is hurt. Yeah. Joy, listen to me. Whoa! What? I can't tell you much, but the man I'm after is very dangerous. Mm. Yo! I don't want anyone Yo! else to <laughs> I can't Kyle! Anyone else to get <laughs> Please understand. But I could be of some help. When the time comes, I'll ask for your help. Really? <laughs> yeah. For sure? Yes. Oh boy. Let's never talk to her again. <laughs> That was Wait, hold tiring. On, actually, before um, I know you, you just need, said a... by the way, to do the boxes, what? you need to um, you know talk to your boss. I the... know. I was trying to find oh, him. Oh yeah, that place. You're welcome anytime. He's in the office. That place? Okay. Carrying crates at the harbor, idiot. <laughs> <laughs> you can go there whenever uh, you like. They'll give you a job anytime. The boss there told me. All right, that would help. Nah, you don't have to thank me. I haven't said anything yet. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> you guys need to figure out what your relationship is. Splash. <laughs> you guys like, are you guys into each other? Or are, you, are you not? I don't get it. All right. Okay, so there are the boxes. Is the office over here? Is that it? There's the eatery. Oh, man. Do you uh, have any idea where the office is? I don't remember. Let's see. What is his name? Maps. Oh, hold on. Maybe I could look at Mr. Map. Sun. Mr. Mr. Soon. Sun. Sun, Mr. Golden Sun. Let's see where his office is. Here, there's a map here, which I'm like way too close to. Let's see. Okay, let's see. Uh, yeah, this area. Warehouse tent. Okay, Fortune's office. Yeah, that's right? what you want, I think. I thought it was. I thought I looked right by there. So it's kind of like right by the entrance. It must be, is it literally, like, because I was trying to talk to the guys moving the boxes, but is the, oh, oh God. It's I right want to say that Come on. Joy that's took us here the first time. Yeah, maybe? that's why I was, I don't yeah, because that's why I was asking her, because I, th- I think she was the one that sort of directed us to come here. Okay, I remember this guy. Hey, boss. <laughs> oh, it's you. Hey, hey boss. Well. Where have you been for the last sure, two weeks? I guess. <laughs> Are you getting along with Joy? No. I'm not. No, I couldn't I'm tell not. you honestly. <laughs> Don't let her push you around. <laughs> I need help right now. Do you have time to work for me right now? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's get started. All right. Sure. Don't move the top half of your face. How is this city surviving? <laughs> <laughs> this is how it works. People just like show up at some, whenever they want. Ah, I'll come work for four hours and every other week or so. Gosh, I well, don't remember how to do this. Start right away. Let's see. And carry those crates. Carry those crates. Okay. 
uh, press in the allotted time. If no direction is given, press forward. Okay. So I hold forward, basically. Yo! Good to see you again! <laughs> That's right, Dellen. Let's get started. Oh, he's super into this. Okay. That's right. We're going to carry it over there. <laughs> that guy's the best. I like real thing. Sure. Left. Okay. Left. Okay. Unless I tell oh, you he, otherwise, keep okay. pushing forward. Sure. Sure. Oh, that's right. <laughs> 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 Left. Uh. <laughs> right. <laughs> I forgot about all this. That's so funny. I missed the forklift, I think. Hey, I hit it. What are you doing? I swear I do blame this D-pad on the Xbox 360 controller. I we'll see. Be silent on this one. Oh, you dropped it. No. Uh-uh. Unless I'm just, I sh I'm like holding up. Maybe I shouldn't be Here. holding up. Maybe I should just be. Yeah. Right. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Right. Right. All right. There's one. All right. We're putting it down. <laughs> <laughs> so that's like what three hundred dollars there. Right? Oh man, at least a grand. I don't remember how much I get paid, but it's okay, not a lot. Okay. Next. Sure. His face is the <laughs> sure. best. Next, we'll carry this. It's like a different art style. <laughs> sure. Rio's just like, whatever, Here. man. Let's just, let's just get the job done. Left. Uh, Left. Don't ever tell. Well, actually, this yeah. guy needs to get a job with a moving company. He'd be yeah. in heaven. Right. He's very good at what he does. Right. Okay, there we go. Uh -huh. <laughs> that never gets old. Left. Also, right. why are we going back and forth like this? <laughs> right. Makes no sense. His style is very strange. <laughs> <laughs> gotta mix it up, I guess. Yeah, I gotta keep keep it keep it interesting. Yeah. But look how he just yeah. eases himself in to the the, cr the crack there. Right. Oh. oh I almost right. hit right. What? What? Oh, we're putting it on top. Oh we're man, I thought it would have gone left. I know. I I I actually I did press left, but thankfully Here. it didn't uh didn't acknowledge. That was we're perfect. Looking pretty good. <laughs> yeah, we are. <laughs> Dream okay, Weaver. <laughs> sure. <laughs> sure. Sure. Next, we'll carry <laughs> this one. Does this guy have a name? Sure. I don't remember. Sure. Is it Dellen? Sure. Right. It's what the walkthrough says. Maybe Dellen's okay. someone else. I mean, that. your guess is good yeah. line. I, know, I want an action figure of him. <laughs> he has a button on the back that just goes. Right. <laughs> <laughs> God damn, I wish we could make Left. that. Left. Your text message alert? Yeah. <laughs> I might do right. that. I can set that up. Right. Ah, Just for when you text it. me. Just for <laughs> <laughs> There we go. Got a little Here. got a little overconfident there. Uh oh. Left, left. I had an unanswered comment. It was part two yeah. of Roy's comment. Yeah. Or no. Right. Right. Oh, I lost it. We're putting Someone it asked down. what our favorite Chinese food is. Chinese food? Chow mein for me. Chow mein? I, I'm pretty boring. I usually get like the sweet and sour chicken and okay, like maybe next. some white rice. Mm, that's good. Sure. I'm not, and it's not like, that sounds like a very plain next, meal. We'll I'm not like a sure. plain picky eater, but I don't know. I just usually, if I want Chinese food, I just want like some, some just chicken, some right. white rice, you know, maybe some egg rolls. Right. Egg rolls are good. Cream cheese wontons? Yeah. I had, I had a bunch of those last night, actually. Left. We're just naming everything on Lian Chin's <laughs> <Right>. menu. <laughs> Left. I've only been to Lian Chin's like once, actually, because we didn't have them in the South. And I think we went there for lunch once. Yeah, you what, know, is, with the what is the big right, Chinese right. establishment in... Oh, I hit the wrong. In I the South. Right, there isn't right. really. Um, the right like, there's no, right. like, even... Was it uh, Panda Express? Like, you won't even find those down there. Uh, so, you know, just local Left. Chinese uh, places. Oh, man. I can't what talk about Chinese doing? food and press buttons at the same time. Focus. Uh, Wake up. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I was up late playing Resident Evil 7 last night. Yeah, someone, Paul, uh, in our YouTube left. comments, Paul McLennan, or Paul McLellan, says, uh, make sure you read the scrolls that you receive so you learn the moves. And he says, oblique air kick. Oblique air. That's a good one to do. I guess... Okay. We might have it. Left. Yeah. Yeah. 
Mega right, Chris right. the Killer says right. Aberdeen is in Scotland. What the hell? How many I'm times look this do you up. Have to Oh, I, I, I agree with that. This I don't know. I'm struggling with this one because it's not giving me the audio cue every time I press the button. Like, sometimes this is not even doing it. Uh, all right, let's see. Right. Right. Okay. There we go. Right. That, like right there. Like, I pressed right a number of times and it didn't this? give me the audio this cue. And then, I don't know. Maybe I'm not doing this right. Do you think when he woke up in the morning, he's like, it's a red pant day? <laughs> right. I was that, super this pressing right. I'm just going to stare at you for the rest of this. Episode. I don't know what else what to do, do here. If you keep doing this, wake up. I do need to get paid. I need $500 here. to give to somebody. We're putting it down. It's already down. <laughs> <laughs> what has happened? All right. That's it for today. Everyone can go home. All right, how much money do I get? Aberdeen is in Scotland yes, and in Washington. We were both right. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, did I get any money? Next time. Here's what you earned. Paper. Four great oh, so God. $40. This is going to take a long time. Thanks. No, because we're going to win the rest in fights. Sure. Oh, okay. Because now there's going to be a cutscene. Oh, for real? Supposed. Lee? Tenacious D, the song Lee, underrated. Song Lee? I don't think I know that one. All the, the <laughs> lyric is just Lee. Oh, are we going to learn about this guy? I think I do remember that song now. That song. Doolin. Yeah. You are right. Doolin. Dolan. Oh, Doolin. Oh, Bill, I was waiting for you. Oh, were you? For me. I heard that you're fighting Ren. I went to get some information from him. I'd like to help, but they might come after me if I do that. <laughs> so I thought uh, I'd at least teach you a move. Oh, okay. Teach me a move? Yeah, it's my best move. It's called Brawling Uppercut. <laughs> Pigeons are like, Whoa. Brawling uppercut. Yeah. Give Ren a good blow with this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. I'd really come feel on now. good if you did. Do you want to learn this move? What are we talking about now? <laughs> oh, I'll accept. Y I'm yes, ready. Please. You're a good sport. First, I'll show you how to move your body. <laughs> okay. He's just going to fall back into the casually lake. Casually <laughs> step back. Casually. Then concentrate your strength in your hips and strike. You should pitch. It's <laughs> good form. Do we have to hold that now, pose for 20 it. seconds? I don't think just the way you saw it okay all right so i step back casually just you know normally is he gonna tell me okay <laughs> <laughs> yeah warm up a little so uh no no you step backwards i did the enemy lowers his guard then really it's a common way to fight at the harbor. All right, I trust you. He keeps getting closer to the ocean here. <laughs> He's really playing with fire. Okay, so I step back. Good. Okay. That's the move. <laughs> Next, thrust your fist as you step back twice. Okay, so I double tap Let's back. Let's see you do it. Okay. I'm double tapping back here. Hey, why aren't you thrusting your fist? Uh, I said swing your fist up to the sky. First time you told me. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Do it. You're an awful teacher. It's getting kind of heated. Do I? All right. You're not stepping back. Okay. Two okay. steps. All right, all right. Two steps. Okay. Not so. good. I'm double tapping Take back. Two steps back and thrust your fist up. Not good. Yeah, I I know. Can you just Take give me the freaking back. command? Thrust back, back, up or something. <laughs> All right, I'm just see. gonna leave. <laughs> <laughs> you have fun. No. <laughs> you guys. It's you, way too late. It's getting really intense. Take yeah. You step back. It'll be more powerful. Okay. All right. I still don't, he looks so goofy doing it. I still don't quite understand. I was like, back, 
back back X, I good. think. They That's want you to use that. You got to use that move in these fights. Yeah. Your coaching okay. is good. Was it? Really? Hey. Well, I thought so. <laughs> Your coaching you was adequate. An uppercut. If you connect, it'll give Ren a good blow. Do you want to practice more? No. I got it. Clearly, I, I have it perfectly. We'd never want to I hear you scold us again. <laughs> we only want to hear you grunt as you move when boxes. You knocked Ren down. Yes, I will. I'm looking forward to it. Cool. Brawling uppercut has been mastered. You got a lot of faith in me to consider that mastered. Okay. All right, so, I mean... At this point, I just got to make some money, right? Yeah. So we're going... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on. These guys are fishing. Let's That's see. Pretty cool. Mike Dai Wan. Our rock. <laughs> <laughs> go to the docks, blah, blah, blah. Now, with this move, you can go back to Beverly Hills Wharf area and do the street fight challenge against the caveman. So that oh, was that center arena, right? Gotcha. Okay. You think I got time to do it? Do we I have think time? You do. Yeah. Do we have time to do it in this episode? Yeah. We got, well. It's like we could make it the first thing we do. Yeah. Let's do that. Can That's do a that? good starting point. All right. I think, well, I, you know, I can save whenever I want. I was going to say I, I could go sleep at that free place. And we are really honestly trying to do more episodes quickly. Um, the next episode actually probably won't have your comments. I apologize. Yeah. So we'll be reading your comments for two days worth in yeah, one. Yeah, because we're gonna we're gonna episode. try to shoot a couple episodes back to back, so we're not. Yeah, we're gonna try we to get some three catch of them up to do here. We gotta get this thing done so we can play Shenmue Three <laughs> yeah. when it launches on June eighteenth, twenty nineteen. Oh, you're calling now? Okay, that's that's a bold move right there. I won't be able to get in here for you. Oh, really? Okay. Well, we can save here. I like. I was gonna go try to go sleep at that place, but I guess I have to go all the way back to my apartment or something. But what happens first in your life? Well, you see Star Wars Episode Nine. Or the pre the next presidential election happens, or Shenmue Three comes out. Um, I think I. Let's see. So this year, I think I see Star Wars Episode Nine before all those things, right? See, this year's 2017. So yeah, we would get 2019. We'll we'll see get it Star Wars in Episode Nine, and uh, then presidential elections 2020. Yeah, uh, and then Shenmue Three, 2021. The future is the release date for that game. <laughs> Well, that was a good episode. Good progress. We're yeah, finally we're starting progress. to make story progress after our duck deviation. <laughs> yeah, duck deviation. Uh, next episode, we're going to be taking on something called a caveman, apparently. Yeah, I got um, to give them the uppercut. So. The Ren of Heavens are going to feel our blow fist. And then that'll be, we'll be done with the game, right? Like, that's probably the end. Uh, yeah, we're about, almost halfway. Oh, okay. All right, we'll get that. Oh, those are real tears. All right. <laughs> we'll see you next time, everyone. <laughs>